Hello there, this is Valhalla and the Lords of Infinity for the Amiga. Was that typed in word? Oh, this must be the copy protection bit that's already been bypassed. Uh, we shall just type in... Yes. Oh, something's going to happen. <laughs> okay, something wonderful. Yeah, I'm assuming that there's some intro here. The private affair, okay. Marketing. The camel group? I want to see those guys. Daz, hello, how you doing? Looks like there is an intro, nice. I am the kid, I am the I have a sad story to tell. This castle was my home. I lived here with my family. We ruled over the land. Shep 16, hello, how you doing? We never knew of fear or sadness, and then one day the sky fell. My father had a younger brother. His name was the Lord of Infinity. It was him that caused the war through his desire to be king. We fought for three long years. Thousands died, thousands. My father was the last to fall. Infinity took the throne, and Valhalla was no more. It was said the sky grew black, and sunlight turned to darkness. I escaped certain death, and was taken into exile. Today I come of age. I am ready to return. We must travel to Valhalla, so I can face my destiny, and destroy my father's murderer, in the name of justice. In the name of Valhalla. Okay, seems interesting. This is Bob's favorite. I've never played this one before. So, Lord of Infinity, this is the sequel to Valhalla Before the War. So that might explain why the intro doesn't look as good, but still pretty good. Also, I noticed a problem with the speech as well. I think that might be an emulation thing, but otherwise it was okay. Oh, here we go. A crypt. Very nice. Uh, do we just click to get out of that? Ooh, this is the first, the first puzzle of the game. Fire. Oh, okay, so it's uh, joystick commands like before. Okay, so kind of very much like uh, before the war, in a way the characters are moving around. Um, how do you? Ah, oh, there we go. So. It's a door key. Can we pick up the door key? I've got it. You can. Amazing. So I'm kind of familiar with the interface uh, from before the war. I was still bad at that game, but uh, I guess I saw knew how to get around. Smells like a drain. There's nothing here. Except blood, perhaps? Okay. I guess he's used to seeing blood. It's an ornament. Uh, you say ornament? Tastes like raspberry jam. I hope not. That would be worrisome. Okay, um, take the book. I've got it. Yes, 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 you have. Oh, here we go. Uh, from his black heart, he summoned the guardian and her offspring. He buried them deep within the crypt to protect the sacred keys of infinity. 
although the floors crumbled all around. Daz, thank you very much for the three stream streak. Thank you. Ooh, what's that? An E? What? Some kind of symbol? Can you look at that? The identity stone. The identity stone, did he say? It's an ornament. I can't take that. Can't take it. Another drain, okay. Ooh, okay, that's a very obvious, well, coin, I believe. It's a gold coin. Gold coin, that is a very big coin. I've got it. I kind of prefer no music. I just, I quite like the ambience of just the wind as opposed to the sequel where it's just... I don't know, it's very sort of dreary, it's just like dom, 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 and they just kind of loot you know, in that five seconds. Lots of drains, um, actually was there something else other than the coin? It's a locked door. Okay, can we use... Can we operate on it? I can't do that. Uh, it doesn't fit. Oh, okay. Never mind then. There's a crack. There's a crack there. I don't know if that's anything. There's nothing here. Oh, okay. There's nothing here. Just for it looks a little bit more distinct. There's nothing here. Than all the other floors. Unicorn, hello. It's a skull. Oh, that's the um yeah. <laughs> that was um you got that on Amiga Power, didn't you? The um it's a skull remix. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Begin to understand where they got all these samples from. Oh, it's a lot of cracks there. Um, yeah, better because this is a save heavy game, so let's take that opportunity of that. Are those traps? Uh, I guess that answers that question. That was very opportunistic <laughs> that we did that. Is that a trap? It's a locked door. It doesn't fit. Oh wait, that was a that was a door key, wasn't it? It's a door key. Yeah. Okay. So fair enough. Uh, what's this? Some kind of helmet? It's a skull. Oh. Wait, you say bring me blood? It's a skull. Bring me blood. Sounds like bring me blood. But yeah, that's part of the music, the um, yeah, the remix, wasn't it? It's a skull, it's a skull, it's a, it's a, it's a skull, it's a skull, it's, yeah, it's a, it's a skull. Okay. 
Can we pick that up? Probably not. I'm not that strong. Um, it doesn't fit. So the game is big sexy. Uh, that's debatable. I do like his flappy hair though. Quite well animated. Oh, okay, there's a key there. It's a door key. Another door key. I've got it. The altar is Okay, altar of sadness. It kind of looks like a statue. I'm not quite sure. It's a stool. Did you say a stool? It's an altar. In the original release, you couldn't see the floor traps. They had to release this updated one with the traps clearly marked. Oh, okay. I did not know that. That would have been incredibly annoying. Just like falling randomly through pit traps. That would have just, yeah, that would have just greatly sucked. Yeah, not, not a good idea to have, because this feels like a really, really big adventure. And to just like suddenly die like that, yeah, that pose a lot, you know, pose a very big problem. It's a scow. What is your quest? Uh, another locked door. Game's a big old troll. It doesn't fit. It doesn't fit. I mean, I never expected this game to just uh, completely take off like a rocket. So we've got, uh, what's that, another coin? Or maybe a very shiny pie? I suppose, hang on, let's have a look. Talisman of Light. Talisman of Light. Okay, let's uh, grab that. I've got it. Want to go home. <laughs> what? Um, okay. That's a weird response. I want to go home. Diagonal arrows. 
or maybe they're pointing to either hidden traps or hidden items, maybe? Oh, what's this? Is that another book? Okay, then. Okay, whilst running an errand, I lost my way and found myself wandering in the dark passage ways of the crypt. I nearly perished in the rooms beyond the chasm. Luckily, I remember to pick up the... That's where it gets torn off. Uh, can you flip the pages? I want to go home. You operate stuff like that? No. Like a hidden switch or something. Okay, so we moved all that way just to uh, read a book. There wasn't anything else there, was there? I try the keys there. It doesn't fit. It doesn't fit. Oh, okay. That will open the door, I'm guessing. Yay. God. <laughs> His voice is kind of annoying. A few, was that a few weeks ago Jet played? He will see you. Ah, yeah, he did actually tell me about that. It's an alright game. Like quite a easy going manage management sim. I'm guessing all of these are all of these are traps. Yeah. I do enjoy doing that. And another key. Winning our total to a grand for three. A tiny key. Oh, whoops, that one. <laughs> A bit roary there. So it didn't work. I tried picking it up, but just no. The crystal flame. A crystal... What did it say? The crystal flame. A crystal flame? I thought it was just like another book. I'm not that strong. Oh, did... Okay, I was expecting that 
to open the door, but uh, looks like, um, what's that, a gem appeared there? Okay, a crystal. And it said, what was this? So, it sounds like a crystal flame, but it's like an altar, isn't it? So do we put the crystal on the crystal flame altar? Okay, now what? Well, I was hoping something would happen. Okay, and there's another talisman, but what's this? Oh. The miracle stone. Miracle stone. I'm not that strong. The lock shed. Oh, okay, might be for the tiny key. Okay, so in that room we just got a crystal, nothing else, no other way of progress unless we go back down here. Is there anything else in this room? Oh, okay, what is this? Water of hope, did it say? I'm not that strong. Okay, um, I believe I'm officially stuck. It doesn't fit. What do you mean it doesn't? F I haven't tried any items, did I? Or did I? It doesn't fit. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, good game. Hope everyone enjoyed that. Okay, now what? I just thought that would do something. I've got it. Okay, those two areas I don't think I've checked out. What does it say here? It's a, big stone. a big stone, you say? Now I'm guessing we can't pick up the big stone because it's too big. I'm not that strong. Fair enough. And what, do we put our letters there? It's a bloodstone. Bloodstone, did it say? That would explain the blood around it. Can you just operate it as it is? I can't do that. The altar was stagnant. I can't do that. 
Okay, well, um, I guess we <laughs> track. I have no idea. We've got an amulet of light, two door keys, and a tiny key. And I'm not sure what to do with any of it. Now he says, bring me blood. And there was an altar that sort of mentioned that as well. What was it called? The Bloodstone? The altar was desperate. Actually, I don't know, looking at the floor tile sideways, can you put the key in that? Just looks like there's a key, or rather a key shape on that floor tile. It might be a stretch, but... Okay, um, I don't know then. Oh, wait a second. Wait a minute. Something slightly different there. Floor tile. I don't know, there's something on it though. There's nothing here. I don't understand. Incredible. <laughs> Are you sure? Whatever you say. There's nothing here. Oh yeah, it turns out there is, yeah. Oh, that's the map. Oh, okay. We didn't really need that, did we? But I'm guessing this would have been vital for like the early version. Because they were not... There's nothing incredible about this. God, I get excited about everything. Uh, identity stone. So we start putting items on there. Let's have a look. Okay, now what? This crystal. I've got it. Actually, you know what? I take that back. This might actually be worse than before the war. I mean, before the war was still very much convoluted, but at least there was a, it had a bit more going around, like there was lots of sort of things to do. Whereas here, it's just, I don't know, just kind of samey, isn't it?
Okay, so now we're back at this bit. Put the crystal there, perhaps. I mean, it looks kind of cool, but it doesn't do anything at all. Maybe you're supposed to fit in something spherical in there. Oh, like the talisman. Or the coin. Okay, let's, yeah, let's uh, put in the coin first. Let's try dropping them in there. Okay, now what? I've got it. Have no more room. No more room. I don't think you could pick that up anyway. Okay, now what? Um, just wondering, do we need the map? It's a stool. It is a stool indeed. Oh, I don't think I recognize this bit. Looks different. A little way. Okay. It kind of looks like a toilet, but okay. Uh, wishing well. Oh, okay, so we put the coin in here. I'm going to save it first before trying. Okay, now what? Oh. <laughs> now what? What's happened there? Coin disappeared. Okay, we actually solved a puzzle. The one and perhaps only time in this game. A large gem. A large gem this time. I've got it. Okay, I don't think we need the books. So if we just drop... I don't think we need the books. There's nothing here. Okay, now what? There's nothing here. I don't like that he has to comment on virtually everything. Well, whoop, let's uh, take that stick. I've got it. Oh, there's something else there as well. Uh, what did we do before? Does it just operate? Incredible. My father's ring. Okay. Father's ring. Okay, so we dropped the coin in the well, and in return we got a gem, and then down there we got a stick, and a hidden bit revealed your father's ring. I have no idea what would go where. An 
I don't think we could always do... We're full up of stuff. Water of Hope. I don't think we've got any items that's compatible with that. Unless you put a gem there? I, I really don't know. Still don't know what he says there. I mean, I would assume that we dropped it there last time. Crystal flame, and he dropped the crystal on this bit. I can't do that. Okay, then. And that was an amulet that we couldn't pick up. Baz, hello, how's it going? Stand in full action. Um, Miracle Stone. Do we operate it with the Amulet of Light, perhaps? It doesn't fit. Yeah, and uh, welcome to welcome to this game. Not exactly an exciting opener and i was going to say but but there isn't really yeah we we'll just leave it as that it's just yeah it's uh it's as interesting as it looks i think i tried that before yeah. I mean, we could brute force stuff, just put in all the items and see if anything works. Joe Crew, hello, how's it going? Uh, just dropping by to ask if anyone remembers the Postman Pack Pat Amiga game. Probably not the same one that you're thinking of, but I did play one. I did play a game called Postman Pat Three uh, some months ago. Oh, and yeah, I don't remember it having. Uh, I don't remember that particular version anyway, having Runaway Sheep. But no, I don't. I don't think I've played that one you're referring to. And also, hello. Okay, 
tower. I got it. Okay, now what? I got it. Okay, now what? I got it. Okay, now what? I got it. Yes, I really hate brute forcing my way through, but at the moment I've got no ideas. I got it. Okay, now what? It just seems, uh, it just seems very sort of drab. Like there's nothing really of interest or intrigue. And it's a shame because I normally quite like uh, watching graphic adventures anyway. You know, especially, no, I won't even mention Monkey, you know, not even Monkey Island, but stuff like Hook was better than this. Because at least I had a bit of variety. There was a bit of, yeah, there was a bit of interest even in that game. But here's just like all the items feel very generic, like keys, rings, gems, talismans. I got it. It's a skull. What is your plan? So he says, what is your quest? And do we drop an item as an answer? Okay, now what? Like a gem or something. Okay, now what? I got it. Okay, now what? I got it. That's a very big altar, assuming it is. I'm not that strong. Oh, sorry. Look at it. It's an altar. Oh, thank you. So we got altars, we got stalls, blood is everywhere. More stalls. That was the altar of sadness. Um oh do we put the ring on the altar of sadness? But did his father die and that was his ring? I don't know. And that sadness is inherited on said said ring. No? Okay. I got it. That was so much from my thought process. The altar of sadness. Talisman of light. Uh, cast some light over the sadness. The symbol kind of looks like, like on the side it's sort of like a horizon, so it looks like the a sun could be peeking out from it. Uh, hence the amulet of light. Okay, now what? I got it. Okay, now what? I got it. We 
we've got the boulder there. Oh, do we put... No, we don't put the rin in there, surely. Either said blood, it either says bloodstone or blood stove. Okay, now what? I've got it. There was a skull that said bring me blood. Okay, now what? I've got it. Or maybe you just um, operate it? Is that a grey button on the side? No, it's not. I can't do that. Mm -hmm. Okay, now what? I've got it. Okay, now what? Let's try the crystal last. Okay, now what? I've got it. Oh, do you use a stick to uh, lever up the large rock? Um, so I guess it will be operate. Oh, okay, so it's just assume that you always insert uh, items into other stuff. Okay. I'm not that strong. Can you put something on top of it? No. It didn't work. Also, it feels like the areas are um, unnecessarily large. Uh, there's lots of uh, long pathways before you get to like the next door. I feel like everything was, if everything was just a little bit more closely put together, uh, there'll be less navigating around. I'm guessing the other key doesn't. I might have already tried that as well. It doesn't fit. I'm not that strong. Uh, what was this one again? The altar of justice. Altar of justice. Um, father's ring. Cause was his father the kin? And kin's supposed to resemble justice. Okay, now what? I guess not. I've got it. Okay, now what? I've got it. I'm not that strong. Okay, now what? I've got it. Okay, now what? I've got it. Okay, now what? Okay, not sure then. Not sure.
And then, yeah, also scouting around for um, like special wall tiles. But yeah, like that one. Okay, now what? I've got it. Hoping it's this. Okay, now what? Oh, oh, it is. Okay. <laughs> Identity. So we used, um, didn't expect that to work but um yeah i was hoping it did because it was like we find so we use the identity stone to find out what our father's ring is all about that was my assumption i didn't expect that to appear whatever this is it's a, parchment. a parchment okay No, 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 not examine. Okay, birthright. We, the undersigned, we, the undersigned hereby declare that this, our kingdom of Valhalla, be governed in accordance with the unspoken law. Let the firstborn son of the higher kin of Valhalla be the only true and rightful heir. For the good of all citizens, for the honour of our homeland, our will be done. Signed on behalf of the people of Valhalla. Incredible. No, it's not. <laughs> it's a, it feels like the game is like self-congratulating it. Stop it. Uh, keep going down. So, do we give? Do we give that parchment to the skull that says, what is your quest? Ah, oh, here, we, here we go. That's the one, isn't it? It's a skull. Bring me blood. Oh no, that's the one that says, bring, bring me blood. We have to keep going down. The place is too big and he is too slow. It's not a good combination. Okay, so do we do we drop the parchment there? And say that state that this is our quest. Okay, now what? No. Okay then. I've got it. Yeah, we know <laughs> you just left it there two seconds ago. Or do we just now we're just stretching? Okay, now what? I've got it. Can you pick up the skull? Oh. I can't take that. Why not? It's a skull. It's a uh, skull sized. You should be able to pick that up. And then just have it carry 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 it around with you and just uh, keep saying, What is your quest? Wait, the um bricks there look different to the one on our on the right. Is that something? Oh, okay, I guess not. I thought you could push those bricks. I don't know, for some reason those bricks look more distinct on the left than they do on the right. Another save.
Do we drop the parchment there? Okay, now what? I've got it. I mean, I do applaud Vulcan software on one thing. It's certainly different. And not just the Valhalla series, but also uh, the other few games they've done as well, like uh, Time Keepers, which was like this, but in a. It was sort of a cross between Valhalla and Lemmings. I remember playing a demo of that. And of course, um, yeah, he'll see uh, Lido as well the beach sim. I'm not sure if they did any other games besides that. But uh, yeah, it's a nice idea, but it's just painfully slow. Oh, do we... <laughs> we put the coin in the well and got the gem. Do we put the gem in the well? And then what do we get out of that? Like a bigger gem? That'd be funny. No, okay. I'm guessing the well was just for the coin and nothing else. Probably pointless. It didn't work. Okay. We did it say they didn't work, rather than you'd expect it to say I already tried that. I can't take that. It's a cow. What is your quest? Do you put the parchment in there? Or just drop it in? Okay, now what? No. Okay, we are approaching the hour. Um, yeah, this one's a bit um, this one's a bit dreary, isn't it? And I know before the war was also a bit dreary, but at least there was a bit more to it. Like it gave you a few. Well, then again, I think we were lucky with before the war because we had to get that potion of invulnerability to just walk past that fire. But once you were past that, you saw there was a lot to explore. Like, even if you couldn't really solve any puzzles, there's still quite a few characters to interact with. Whereas here, it's just, um, I mean, I'm not saying there's, um, not saying it's going to be like this for the whole game, but uh, for the beginning bit anyway, it feels like a, a very uh, dreary experience. And yeah, if you like this game, obviously, um, you know, I'm not having a go at you. I just, yeah, I just find it a bit slow, a bit tiresome. And uh, yeah, just uh, a little bit on the boring side. But um, like I said, at least, you know, at least it's something different. At least it's something different to get my teeth into.